There is a saying that peace comes from being able to contribute the best that we have and all that we are toward creating a world that supports everyone. But it is also securing the space for others to contribute the best that they have and all that they are. It is a transformation. Act, Change, Transform organization, ACT, with support from the Royal Danish Embassy, has been implementing the Peace, Security and Stability program in several counties since 2016. One of the pillars in our strategic plan um, over the last 10 years is peace building and conflict transformation. So the PSS program plugs into this program and strengthens our agenda as a program in implementing activities out in the field with the communities in a way that addresses different forms of conflict that impact uh, citizens uh, in one way or another. To many people, Madari Valley, an informal settlement in Nairobi, just like many informal settlements, is known for many things but synonymous with violent crime. And if not election-related violence, then other forms of conflict. But one Alphonse Were, a champion of Usalama Kijijini under the Madare for Peace Initiative, has literally taken the words of Eleanor Roosevelt into action that it isn't enough to talk about peace. One must believe in it. And it isn't enough to believe in it. One must work at it even in awkward circumstances of COVID-19. Through this dialogue, I have been working with MPI, I have been working with MPI. Due to the fact that the landlord is very good, and we have been working with them, and we have been working with them. So, there is a amount of money, and the landlord is going to be able to get rid of it, and we have been able to get rid of it, and we have been able to get rid of it. From March up to the end of Saba, to reach about 17,000 people, when you tuli wafikia uh, directly not indirectly directly wale wenye tulikuwa tuna engage nao kila siku baada ya siku with the support from the royal danish embassy act has been able to support madare for peace a community based organization to be able to conduct weekly dialogue and forums around root causes of conflict and their negative impact on the community how to manage and prevent conflict and empowering the residents with the opportunity to come together as they identify challenges in their community and work to achieve urban slum transformation. From the onset, it became necessary and important for the PSS program to design and build the capacity of local level civil society organizations to be able to address emerging conflict and improve collaboration between CSOs and government agencies. The Peace, Security and Stability Program not only addresses conflict and violent extremism, but also increases women's leadership role in peace and security activities. PSS has been able to increase the use of local information by relevant national and county government agents in developing and implementing peace and security policies, action plans and strategies. KEFRA and ACT came on board to train the Committee of, Cons of Justice, Law, Constitutional Affairs, Good Governance and Security to see if we can also come up with a peace bill for Kisumu County. In Kilifi County at the Kenyan coast, it is no different. The development of policy frameworks to guide approaches to managing peace and security within the county integrated development plans is exciting. We came up with a draft policy which was addressing some of the issues which have been happening in this county. So basically this policy will set a pace. It will be the blueprint for peace and security programs. Such efforts in peace, security and stability program are going a long way in supporting the people of Kenya in implementing our Vision 2030, meant to create a globally competitive and prosperous country with a high quality of life. We all know that uh, peace and security is very key for governance, for you know, stability of countries, and Kenya being a good partner to Denmark, they feel that you know, there's a need to support peace and, and stability. Uh, it's also a way of ensuring that there's stability in the region. Hakuna nafasi ya ya mapigano kulikuja mpaka tukapitisha eh, elections vile walivyokuwa serikali kuu inatarajia kwamba kutakuwa na mapigano 
hakukuwa na mapigano we have issues of radicalization extremism uh, those kind of conflicts they are there on daily basis and um, we normally mitigate them through our security meetings peace does not mean an absence of conflicts differences will always be there peace means solving these differences through peaceful means through dialogue education knowledge and through humane ways when you talk about peace building and conflict management we want to take the whole society approach where we embed all the aspects that enhances human life in the community because without food uh, somebody will obviously have something to ask about uh, in their communities without access to education without access to quality health care they will always be complaints and that's why we are working with the county governments to ensure that all these aspects are embedded and are enshrined when they are developing their county integrated development plans supporting the social change activists and supporting the young um, human rights defenders in the community, we already have an existing um, network of, of young people who have already been going through, through this program. We had sessions where we had um, members, for example, from the Nation Kenya National Commission of Human Rights. We had um, representatives from uh, offices like the ODPP offices, gender uh, technical committees. So these are some of the networks that they've been able to, to, to build in the program. Katiba ni msumeno, ukatambele na nyuma. Ile katiba ina meno, tena makali ya uma. Nyinyi mkisikia tu jenda bezalens unadhani ni nani? Wanawake. Wanawake. Eh, you see, so through this I have learned a lot that I can also give and also equip my fellow young ladies and also men. Uh, when I get a chance to, I talk to them because most of them as I uh, I usually say think that uh, SGBV or sexual reproductive health rights, it's a girl issue or a women issue, of which uh, when you sit and really reflect, it's a societal issue. ACT, Peace, Security and Stability Program, premises itself on initiatives that encourage public-private contribution to crime prevention while encouraging peaceful coexistence. Talent ni kazi hususan sana sana tunajishughulisha na mambo ya kunacha talent na pia vile vile kuhakikisha kwamba vijana wanatoka katika mazingira ya sokuwa pendezi. Na tunashukuru Mungu akiwa Afrika alitupokea kwa mkono mmoja kwa sababu waliona tukika idol sisi kama vijana huenda tukawa na fikra potofu, tukawa wahuni, tukasumbua jamii yetu. Uh, we mobilize vulnerable young people. We empower them through uh, human rights camps and uh, entrepreneurship uh, trainings. Most of them now, they have uh, started small businesses. Some of them, we have uh, supported them through a small uh, business startup kitty, which the project offered. Through skills transfer and business mentorship, ACT Change Transform organization, in collaboration with stakeholders, has been able to amplify the untapped possibilities and potentials in the youthful population and create job opportunities and businesses through friendly credit facilities and access to ICT networks. That's the person who comes up with a business idea and gathers the resources to actualize the idea. Are we together? Sai nataka kusema nimeri badilika kupitia kwa mkono ya pamoja for transformation. And I'm now reforming other boys who are being used we want them to create employment opportunities. We want these young people to get linked to business opportunities. And we want them to also access entrepreneurship and other services which only business can be able to provide. We have been able to conduct uh, joint activities in Kilifi and uh, Mombasa counties where we have been able to empower and train over 200 youths whom have been able to form, at least out of the, the trainings we have had, 10, uh, 10 youth groups formed who have been economically empowered by youth, youth fund through loans of up to 3.2 million to establish enterprises. business 
Asha pia mimi kuna wengi ambao wao wanaume ambao ha, leo hawako hapa wengi wako kwa mia biashara biashara zao. Niko na watu ambao mwanzoni walikuwa watu ambao walikuwa wanaenda kuiba ngombe kwa Turkana. Na wakiusa asali huwa kila mmoja anapokea pesa kulingana na asali yenye ametoa. Maana kila msinga inatoa pesa shilingi 1000 ikiuzwa. We been able to change the narrative such that the youth have no longer been looked at or deemed as uh, the sources of insecurity and violence within this area. We have created a basis and some change is seen. Actually a lot of change is seen. Human rights with regard to both youth, uh, women and uh, security in terms of elections, security in terms of um, the livelihoods is some of the things that we've tried to do in the various policy presentations that we've requested the counties of Kelefi, the counties of Kisumu to do. And we were hoping that you know this could be actually cascaded across the various countries in, in, in Kenya. It Our youth engagement has been one of the more you know, uh, successful components of PSS. Uh, and so this is something that we really thought about in terms of our continued support to peace and security in Kenya. Uh, we are going to, you know, expand and deepen our youth engagement component. Uh, we will try to see how else, who else we can engage, um, the strengthen our private par uh, public partnerships, uh, strengthen our, you know, job creation uh, linkages, um, and as well as our internship program, which I think is a good way to you know, redirect uh, young people's energies.